Hello, um, just a quickie, just to um, tell you, this week's been impossible as far as creating anything useful is concerned. Um, it's been a really sad week. Uh, our wee dog, Monty, passed away on Monday. She was quite old and pretty sick, so it was better for her, obviously, but it still leaves a big hole in our lives. And she, it seems she was the noisiest person in the house because the house is very quiet, even though we've got two other dogs. There's no grunting, snuffling or snoring happening, well, apart from me, probably. Um, but yeah, and it's made me realise again that when um, we talk about being resilient in different situations, it's good to bounce back, but it has to be appropriate and it has to be in a healthy way. And... The thing is, you, you have to go through emotions. You, you can't control everything that happens in life. And you just have to deal with the things that you can't avoid. That's it. You just have to deal with it in the best way you can. And But the good thing is, if you know how to recover from that. Being appropriate, it means that I need to, I guess I need to use this week and just you know, feel the emotions. She was a delightful wee dog. I loved her dearly and I miss her so much. Um... But it actually reminded me of, there's a, a, what would you call it, a Taoist parable with, um, it's about these two monks who are uh, the travelling. There's an older monk and a younger monk. And the uh, they've taken vows of um, celibacy. They can't talk to women, look at women, touch women or do anything like that. And they come to a riverbank. And there at the riverbank, there's no bridge, but there's a woman and she's trying to get across and she can't. The younger monk turns away. He can't deal with it at all. But the older monk says, OK, I'll carry you across. And he does. And uh, he lets her down at the other side and they say goodbye and go in their separate ways. And about two, mi two miles down the road, the younger monk uh, turns to the older one and said, I don't believe you did that. We are not supposed to look at women, talk to women, but you carried that woman across the river. How could you do that? And the older monk looks at him with great compassion and says, I let her go at the river bank, but it seems that she's still with you. It's really important that we deal with things as they happen. We don't try and avoid them, but if we can get through them, and retain our balance and our contentment, then we can retain our happiness. Just keeping it appropriate. Go through the things you have to, deal with them and bounce back. I hope you have a great rest of the week and a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.